anytime you have a surf competition in Bali, this is a great place to hang out and wait for the waves. Surfing, exploring, partying, chasing girls, hanging out with your friends and family. It's not too hard to get these guys over here to relax and wait for the comp. Bali is paradise. It's like addiction, you know, like once you come here and you want to come back every time. Eat the local food, get massages, drink the Balinese coffee, and surf. Even when pudding, pudding's not working, um, they're just, just surrounded with so many other good surf spots. It's like pudding is the cherry on top, but everything else is the cake. It just kind of feels like a second home. Driving and mopeds everywhere. Just whip every day. You can go party every night. The ultimate two brothers, the ultimate maneuver in our sport. These men are the best at it. And Bethany. Aloha, I'm Bethany Hamilton. I'm 22 years old and I'm from Kauai, Hawaii. Um, today we came down to Kuda to take a bunch of boys from one of the local orphanages, surfing. Bethany Hamilton is the most courageous surfer in our surfing history. She's a warrior. The only female competitor in the history of the Rip Curl Cup. Yeah, I definitely feel honored to be a part of this event. It's a bit intimidating, but I'm not really here to like in a competitive mindset. I'm just here to have fun. You know, that's what surfing is about. Just have fun and whatever happens, happens. Might be taking out some of the boys, most likely. Who knows? You know, this is my absolute favorite time of the Rip Curl Cup. Swell is on its way. It's just charging towards this island. And the anticipation of it all, and the anxiety involved. Ulu should be like 10 foot right Will now. Will the waves be here? Everybody's preparing, waxing their boards. Should we run it? What do you think? I hope they're going to run like, I'm tired of waiting. Um, everyone's here, everyone's pumped, and I mean, you know, when the troops are all together, it'd be a pity not to run. I'm getting excited. Look at this set on the horizon. Look at this, look at this, look at this! It's kind of slow in the morning, and then the sun's coming out, and the wind's picking up, and it looks like the swell's coming up too, so it looks like we're going to do this. Yeah. It's on when it's on. Rizal Tanjum. Black Craig. Ruth Ridiarta. Bethany Hamilton. Wayne the Ted. Ryan Gifford. Maredi Putra. Given. Burez. Lee Wilson. Kalani Chapman. Dere Suriana. Jamie O'Brien. I'm 29 years old. I'm from Pipeline, North Shore of Oahu, and um, yeah, I'm here to surf the Rip Curl Cup. There, there's guys I don't want in my heat, and that, you know, like, I, re I really respect their barrel riding. Ball's one of them, and there's a, there's a list, you know? When I was a kid, Pipeline was, uh, you know, like, you have to, you wanted to prove yourself you go to Hawaii, but I mean, for the Balinese, Padang is one of them, and, like, you want to be standout guys at Padang. And we've waited almost a month for this day. The other surfers in this event are some of and the best barrel riders in the world. I mean, you got Jamie O'Brien, Chris Ward, you've got all Indonesian guys that are as good as anyone. Every set seems to be getting bigger, and, um, and then the little ones become a little bit more bigger, so it's all kind of coming together. Great first hit, start of the day, and then um, got a few good ones, and then, yeah, the best was every one of them. Look at these sets, ladies and gentlemen. Beautiful padang. This is the best padang of the whole year. All the boys, all three caught waves, and then I thought there wasn't going to be another one after, and then a good one came, and I got it, and it ended up being the best wave of the heat. You go parking on, on top of a cliff, you go down to this little cave. It's like it's a full temple garden back there and you know, there's monkeys and it's just like super rad. You walk down this like, you walk down this crack in the rock. It's like, who thought about making this? You go down and suddenly you, you in the barrel, like Padang barrel, just spit out and suddenly like, like, hey, look at this paradise. The white sand, blue water. The atmosphere at the beach to up there and up on the cliff and it's, it's, it's good vibes. Like heaven. <laughs>